Hi everybody. Today I'm going to be showing you how to mix nutrients for smaller plants like herbs and strawberries. They don't eat a whole lot, so it's really easy to mix their nutrients. Let's go ahead and get started. So I am using the General Hydroponics three-part series. We have green, purple, and pink. And on the back of these bottles, they have little recipes. And it all depends on how big your plant is. So if it's a little cutting or seedling, you're gonna use a small amount. Or if it's a plant that doesn't eat a whole lot, like strawberries and herbs. I'm gonna be using cuttings and seedlings. And the recipe for this is a quarter teaspoon of each solution per gallon. Now I have a five gallon jug filled up to the very top. So five times one quarter is 1.25 teaspoons. So I need 1.25 teaspoons of all three solutions. So let's go ahead and measure that out. Grab a medicine dropper, and you can see the medicine dropper has measurements right there, so it's really easy to use this. Shake up your fertilizer bottle, and let's get started. So let's go ahead and see 1.25. That is more than that. Plunge a little bit. That is about 1.25. See how easy that is? And just squirt it right in. Next, we have the purple bottle. And on the back of each bottle is the recipe, and this is a quarter of a teaspoon of purple. So a quarter teaspoon times five gallons is 1.25 teaspoons. So let's go ahead and even this out to about 1.25. Rinse out the plunger. And last we have the pink bottle. Quarter of a teaspoon per gallon. So now that we've done that, let's go ahead and give it a stir and also get a reading. And now I'm gonna be using my Blue Lab Truncheon Meter for that. I love this meter because it is big and it is sturdy. It is waterproof so I can go ahead and bang it around and not be worried that it'll break. And it reaches all the way down into the bottom. So you can see that this light is blinking rapidly and the EC on here is about six. Uh, the EC on here is about 0.6. So that is great for strawberries. Now we're gonna check the pH. And we're gonna be using our Blue Lab pH meter. This is also waterproof. It'll float to the top of the bucket if you just drop it in there, and I know this because I've done it. So right now the pH is about 6.2 and rising. So I know I need to get this water between 5.5 and 6.5 for my strawberries. And I'm gonna do that using pH down. We use pH down very minimally. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill my plunger to about half a teaspoon. Squirt it in there and give it a stir. I still use my truncheon meter for this because it reaches all the way down into the bottom and I like that. And let's check our reading. So we can see the pH is going down, 6.5. Give it a second, give it a swirl. And I want to get that a little bit lower. I'm going to try to get this between 5.5 and 6. So I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit more pH down. I'm going to do another half of a teaspoon. And give it a stir. And let's check it out. Mm. 
And we are going down in pH. We're about 6.2 and still going down. Give it a swirl. Yep, 6.1. I'm gonna go a little bit lower than this even. Just a tad. This time I'm gonna add a little bit less. So maybe a quarter of a teaspoon this time. You don't want to be too liberal with this pH down because if you go too low, you're going to have to pH up. And that's just a whole other bottle of solution. It's not hard to do, it's just not ideal. And let's check out where we're at. We can see that pH is declining. That's great. But not too rapidly that I'm going to have to go ahead and pH down or pH up it. Give it a swirl. And we are holding at six. Let's just add a little bit more. So another quarter of a teaspoon. Again, we stir. And then we test. Give it a swirl. Five point eight, and I am comfortable if it stays between five point eight and five point seven for strawberries. And there you have it. That's how I mix my nutrients in a five gallon bucket using my Blue Lab pH pen, my Blue Lab truncheon meter, and a good fertilizer system, General Hydroponics three-part system with pH down. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.